beloved, we're gathered here today to join together Kenzie Mitchell and Hunter Adams in holy matrimony. Let us pray. unadvisedly or lightly, but discreetly, soberly, and in the fear of God. No other human ties are more tender, and no other vows are more sacred than those you now assume. Hunter, do you take this woman to be your lawful wedded wife, to live together in the holy estate of matrimony, to love, honor, comfort, keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keeping only unto her as long as you I do. lawful wedded husband, to live together in the holy estate of matrimony, to love, honor, comfort, keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep you only unto him as long as you both shall live. I do. with the emblem of eternity and perfection. As the ring is never ending but complete in its form, so is your marriage to be endless but complete in your love for one another. With this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. In love and truth. In love and truth. And with all my worldly goods. And with all my worldly goods. I thee provide. I thee provide. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. In love and truth. In love and truth. And with all my worldly goods. And with all my worldly goods. I thee provide. I thee provide. Inasmuch as Hunter and Kenzie have this day consented together in holy wedlock and have given and pledged their love to one another, in the presence of these witnesses, by the authority vested in me under the laws of the state of Florida, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Hunter, you may kiss your pride. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I live there. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Mr. and Ms. Hunter Adams. Get around, <laughs> 